everybody and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2. Did you enjoy that break with a little battle royale? So break up the monotony of building a park and all that jazz. But today we're doing what I think is supposedly the hardest Jurassic or sorry chaos theory in the game. That being Jurassic Worlds. Build Jurassic World with Simon Rosrani. Succeed where Jurassic Park couldn't. Just be careful what you create. Oh! So I think with this one, we're starting from scratch uh, making Jurassic World. So I'm looking forward to seeing, you know, making the park, but also having the scripted events, or at least from what I imagine that's that's what we're getting. I did, as you'll notice, it's 4% done. Oh, here we go. After we nicked all the dinosaurs. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Oops, oops. I turned off the voices. And <laughs> all right. Here we go. This is where our journey continues. And for many, where theirs came to an end. Isla Nublar. This time, it's not just a park. It's a world. Simon Mizrani believed he could succeed where others before him failed. Maybe if he had you there to guide him, things would have turned out differently. If only, if only Jeff. Classic world was to be the most desirable destination on the planet. New shows, new exhibits, and yes, new dinosaurs too. The miracles of science meets the magic of entertainment. Bleh. You're not content with letting you see dinosaurs. No, you're being put smack dab in the middle of them, safely. That was the hope. Who's afraid of a little water? But what's swimming in that water? Well, that's another story. Oh yeah, we'll be doing a and lagoons for the first time. What in chaos. about the dinosaurs nature didn't create? All right, now we got voices working. James being a good boy. <laughs> Prepare the new Jurassic World for its grand opening as the world's first consumer facing Dinosaur Park. Yeah? Okay. Uh, be careful what you create. Guests are grouped together by their interests. Make sure you're not the only, only creating Don one Hammond group. had his vision and I have mine. I'd like to think Bye. that had things been different, he and I would have been good partners. His passion combined with my business savvy. It would have been quite the team. But alas, it was not to be. And I was left to pick up the pieces of what might have been and turn it into what should have been all along. A premier world-class tourist destination. The only place on the planet where you can experience dinosaurs up close and personal. Here, people will once again discover the wonders of this world. They will have a renewed sense of life and they will gladly, willingly, eagerly Pay for that experience. Give up their lives Science for it. Science didn't bring back dinosaurs. It brought back possibilities. Hope. This is what I see. This is Jurassic World. Yeah, Mizrani, not gonna lie to you. It really isn't much. <laughs> there we go. We sped run San Diego in just over an hour. I think it was an hour and a half, if that. So... I, I kind of do and don't Things want to speedrun this. Shape. I want to just enjoy it. But we need a response facility. Oh, and oh a dear. Paleo medical facility as well. Get it built and ready. Well, do we have the science? Is the question. Oh, we do. Oh, that they're just enough. <laughs> just enough. So I think this is it. This is going to be like the biggest. Oh, it's even oddly shaped like it was in the original. That's interesting. Um, yeah. Oh, is all oh, the dinosaurs here at all? I, I, I mean, this is Nublar, right? Where's the, where's the formation? There it is. Look at that. Oh, they've even put the, the center up here. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah, they did it. Oh, that's brilliant. That's where the T-Rex roars, or at least somewhere kind of roars. So this is where Claire goes with her elevator and goes, welcome to Jurassic World. Right. Let's construct that response facility. Really, it should be by, uh, what do you call it? It should be by the, um, uh, the dinosaurs, because then it's got less travel distance. But, uh, hey ho, we'll do that. We'll, we'll construct it there and a paleo medical facility, which I'm assuming we'll also need to research. And we need, oh, we need more scientists. So, from what I've read, 
Um, I think I need more logistics. So we need a logistics specialist here. Yeah, from what I've read, people have said that this is one of the only uh, chaos theories. Faster expeditions? Oh, we'll definitely need that. Heck yeah. I've seen him before. He's a good He's a good egg. Um, uh, wait, have... Oh, we just need four scientists. Oh, okay. Um, right. So let's keep an eye out for any tens. Hmm. We have no tens. Cheaper research, which would be good. 454, 436, 454. Uh, I mean, that's good with logistics and a good welfare. Zachary. We could get a Zachary. Uh, and then eight for welfare, a generalist. I kind of want cheap research, though. Um, six and a five. for Yeah, we'll go for go. We'll go for Owen. We've got our own Owen Grady. Right, there we go. Now we can research this. And it is... Ooh, well, we got cheaper research. And then we need welfare. Yeah! Solid! Brilliant! We need to save money where we can. And by howdy are we going to do it? Paleo medical facility. Okay, wait for that to be. Uh, I'm wondering what our first dinosaurs are going to be. No, I've made it! You fool! Ooh... Ooh, I should go and research and see what we got. Paleo medical facility. A uh, bit big. I like how it's kind of similar to the map that we had in um, uh, Evolution 1. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'll tell you what, what we'll do is we'll move this out the way a little bit. Uh, I mean, we could probably just put it here, to be honest. Yeah! What do you mean? What's got no power? Well, it'll get power in a second. Don't worry. Paleo medical facility. Yes. Do we put that there? That the best? There, that'll do. Okay. And then we'll connect this over to here. Still haven't found the perfect way to place all of these so they all fit together. There will be one. I'm sure that people have already done it. Right, what's the next thing? Now that we have these dinosaurs... Oh, go oh God! Oh, God! ...suitable enclosures. These assets are central to our operation. No dinosaurs. Oh, no God. Jurassic world. Please right, okay, so we're, I'm going to pause it because... Accordingly. Jesus. Um, <laughs> we're going to need it. So, actually, maybe we make the... I mean, what we got? Triceratops and Ankylosaur. I think they'll, they're will they okay. I think it's literally Ankylosaur... Oh, sorry, Stegosaur. Yeah, Stegosaurs and Triceratops don't get on together. Like, the the, um, the Wajimi calls it. Um, the Ceratopsids and Stegosaurids. They don't get on with each other. But I think if we just place these two here. Um, we still only got level two fence. That'll be fine. I think what I'll do actually is, yeah, we'll put small amenities here. So we'll put, ah, uh, you know, even a medium would be good. Even a medium. Because we're going to have so much foot traffic here that it needs to be a medium. But I don't know if we can have a medium. Right, okay, let's research medium first. Uh, oh, never mind, we can't. You see, that's the problem. Like, when you make a park straight away, you'll be faced with this as soon as you, like, you know, make it. One, you won't be able to satisfy everybody. Two, um, you, you'll need to upgrade them eventually. It's like, ah, damn it. Okay, so hopefully we don't need to research a toilet. We don't. Fantastic. Okay, so we'll get the gifts in as well. Yeah, uh, yeah, you can go there. Hopefully that's all right. Just with the fence having to go, it might be a little bit of an issue. Um, I've also uh, taken off the mod that I had for this, which was instantly build fences and genetic research, because I was like, I, I don't want to cheat. That's that's no fun in cheating. All right. Oh, can't do that, but we can pop it there. So now we need the toilet. The toilet. Or the toilet. Right, so we definitely need... Oh, look at that. It's going to be amazing when this all uh, gets built instantly. So we'll pop that there, pop that there. Um, ooh, tell you what, we'll pop another one there. And can we go straight? Yes, we can. Oh, that's beautiful, beautiful. Now this can be the Triceratops and Ankylosaur enclosure. I think that'll be fine. This is the first time actually making a park. Ooh, oh boy, because I'm not speed running or anything. Uh, this side. Um, ooh, you can, oh, you can just have it go up like that. Oh, brilliant. Because we'll need um, one of those, like, uh, uh, amenities, like the cinema and stuff, to really bring in more of a crowd here. Um, or maybe, you know, we'll we'll just free up some more space. Oh, it'd be so good if you could, like, run parallel, but there's no... Unfortunately, there's no, there's no thing there. So I will just bend that round 
Sort of keeping the same sort of distance. I think that's... That's around about right. And then just... Over that way. Now, this if this is the T-Rex, because we're gonna need it. Um, actually, we'll, we'll keep on curling around, because I didn't realize we haven't gone far enough. Uh, we will need this fairly sizable. Because T-Rex does like a lot of space. Uh, so we'll have that like that. This looks like a park I'm making JPOG, man. <laughs> it's so giving me those, uh, those JPOG vibes. Right, okay. Let's, uh, get that way. Um, and go straight this way. Maybe follow it, curve it around a little bit. And then... There we go. Oh, and now we can play and watch everyone go... Bah! Knee power, though! Um, that's a point, actually. Let's research these. Because we should be able to research these. Um, it was interesting, actually, watching Evo, uh, Squared play this game in comparison to me. She went straight for this. Um, and I was like, nah, I got plenty of power, it's fine. <laughs> I don't need to worry about it. Um, so we will also need, uh, this. And we'll need another one in there, too. Uh, we also will need a... Oh, well, we can't... Uh, I guess we could put one here. I was going to say, are we not rotating? Oh, we are. Oh, it's not. Snap. <gasps> we can't have... Oh, you can't have snap for that. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, okay. Um, right, so we're researching that, and then we can have a power station. Now, I don't know what the storm is like for this one. I'll put a generator here just to cover everything, though. So we're on 7 million. Uh, we, I think... Now, if I remember right, Ankylosaur, like, Triceratops probably wants some forest, Ankylosaur likes ground leaf or fiber. I think it's fiber. So we'll put some fiber down. Of course, they'll all need water. So we'll put some here, put some here. Oh, yes. Yes, look at it. It's perfect almost. Let's have a look. Oh, lovely. Oh, look at that mountain range. Beautiful. See? And there's another mod that allows you to build on, um, on, like, you know, when you try and build, let's say, for instance, if I try and build a fence here, it's red. You can still build that. There's a mod already implemented. I didn't realize that mods were gonna be like, bam, yep, mods are in. <laughs> like, straight away. I was thinking maybe wait for the DLC a little bit. Nah, just go for it. Okay, so there's Ankylosaur. Now, actually, is it gonna be big enough for both of them? Ooh, I don't know. But tell you what, we'll pop in the fence there, or the gate there. We'll pop in the gate there. And then we'll assign one Jeep team to the Ankylosaur, and one Jeep team to the T-Rex. I think we might need a little bit bigger T-Rex, though. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. And then, for the power? Where can we put the power? Maybe there's enough space here. What if we move the generator? Let's have a look. Okay. So, we got this. Oh, 100%. 100%. Okay, let's move this. We'll move this. Yeah, yeah, we'll move that there. And now there should be space. Yes, of course there is. Okay, so we'll move that as far back as we can. Um, and now we need to probably go here and then add a substation here too. So that's that powered. And, you know, we'll, we'll probably put a substation, I think, if we can. Because we don't have an expedition or anything yet. I just realized. Ooh. Yeah, put that there, and then you there, and then, ooh, 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 we've got monkey mode, <laughs> and then we'll curve that round to there, and there you has it, beautiful, right, so we're gonna try Ceratops in three seconds, okay, I just wanna, oh well, I would kind of check on that, but uh, I'm gonna put in for Triceratops, I get the feeling that they're not going to be too happy. We'll check on them. And then the Triceratops are coming in as well. Are they different colors? Uh, it's hard to tell. Did we? I don't think we brought three Ankylosaurs in the last one. We only got one, didn't we? One special Triceratops. Right, okay. They're okay, but what about the trikes? Oh. Trikes aren't happy. Um, they need more forest. Ground fiber's okay. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we're gonna have to probably just extend this a little bit. Just to give the Triceratops what they want. And I think just by doing this, we should be able to do it. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Once we just delete this. Yeah. 
Oh, one T-Rex. Oh, is it just one T-Rex? Oh, okay. Just one T-Rex it is then. Right. Ensure all dinosaurs have 80% comfort. Well, we need to make sure that these guys are all right. So I think this should be enough for the forest. Yeah. Forest is almost done. And then they want some ground fiber here. Yeah, I think they're good. I think we're good. As long as they don't fight each other. And T-Rex, how are what you doing? Uh, that's right, we need to check up on you, don't we? I love when it's night and we can't see anything. It's brilliant. Okay, so the ones will probably slow that down just so we don't keep on losing money. So you want a little bit of forest. You want a teensy bit of sand. And you want a prey. Boom! T-Rex, happy as a sand boy. Right, hold on. Now I need to go into every freaking facility and change it. Oh, is the park not open? Oh, we gotta open the park. That'll be the next one. Okay, I guess we I guess we just quickly lose some money while we wait for everything to be like, yep, it's all good. Park closed. Jurassic open park. World Done. Is the envy of the world. Where uh -huh. else? So do what you can to increase our dinosaur <sighs> visibility. Look at that, Gary! I it's a tyrannosaurus! Every comfort. We should Wait, where is it? Bathrooms oh, there it is. and other things in strategic locations. And I've done it. Emergency shelters. Just in I've case. done it. I've done it. Wait. I've done it. It's a beautiful day to open a new chapter. <laughs> it's just like humanity. running through everything because I've Once already done it. gates are open, there's no going back. That's fine. I've already opened it. Are we gonna We're get a cutscene? Oh, this is okay. Jurassic there we go. World. <laughs> I can't help but wonder what John Hammond would think of all this. He love it. I like how they've kind of. I think they're gonna let us, like, recreate actually Jurassic World. Like this bit of path, um, will be where the lagoon goes, where the mosasaur, I assume, and that that's like kind of like the mainstream. We kind of got a T Rex kingdom. A bit actually almost inadvertently well, made Jurassic World. Guests are having the best Jurassic World experience possible. Increasing our amenity coverage should do the trick. Keep I've almost done it. Comfort numbers and get them where we'd like. And that is up. Oh my god. Okay, well they really want this. Jesus. Are we good? Are we good? Oh, a little bit of that. That's fine. Right. So, I think, does this increase the guest comfort? So, we're on 32%. All right. Still on 32%. Huh. How do we get that up then? And that's that done. Still on 32%. Right. Let's have a look. Interesting. No, we're not making money from that. Crowding's fine. Food and drink is fine. Shelters is okay. Just a little bit of a toilet around here. And I don't know why we would really want a toilet here. But you know what? I'm not going to complain. They want a toilet. They're going to have a toilet. You can also have a lovely hotel. Ha <laughs> ha. Expedition team. Here we go. Right. Okay. So I think just I'm going to build all of the sort of facilities behind here. Behind the innovation center. I guess we could probably build it there, couldn't we? Oh, no, that's out of reach. So can I not delete that? Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. <laughs> so they were like, nope, we need that there, but you're not allowed to build on it. Okay, thank you. Why am I getting a view like I'm a toddler? Look, I'm, I'm at his crotch. I can't see now. <laughs> All right, well, apparently everything's good. Like, by the looks of it, what's this? Guest appeal, all guests. General, general, nature. Well, this isn't open yet, so when that opens, I'm assuming we'll probably push over. Do the guest comfort breakdown in the park rating management. Is this it? Okay. Uh, appeal, 20%. Uh, guest total appeal, 20%. Out of view, out of view. So we need to really step up how I guess view the dinosaurs because otherwise they can't see nothing the last of the viable oh no we did it never mind it was arriving. a hotel let's get them settled in 
Oh god, a Gallimimus? Oh. How about we just have one huge one in the middle? That sounds about right. Yeah, let's do a huge one in the middle. Let's build it round this hotel. Yeah, you know, build it around there. Yeah, like that. And then let's, let's make this a massive enclosure for like a herd of 5 million Gallimimus. Sod the lagoon. We'll have a lagoon somewhere else. But that is gorgeous. Yes. Although, I'm, I'm assuming that maybe we make a tour. A tour is probably the best way to view this. Hey again. Mahoosive. And where do we put the gate? <laughs> right, so they go through here and they can run through that. And then, ooh, I don't know. Hold on, let's uh, let's change where this fence is, shall we? Although apparently it doesn't let me delete the fence, just the path. Wait, why can't I delete the fence? I can delete that one. Is that because it's not connected? Oh, I can delete this one though. There you go. Sweet, what we got? Ho ho ho! One and a half stars already, and making a profit. Yes. Although we probably will need some more amenities soon. Uh, we, we probably need to delete those fences. <laughs> we'll probably need a, a, like a medium or something. So what I'll do is I'll build this back a little bit. And that should allow us the space. I think so. I think we'll be good. Yeah, we'll delete that. And at least still we've got this uh, coverage here. Oh, uh, yeah? Sure. Start placing all the galleys in here, even though the fence isn't done. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> They're gonna love it. This will be the gyrosphere park. That's what this bit can be. Massive gyrosphere exhibit. Uh, and we will need a little bit of power as well. Put it there. And then we can go over to here and... Oh god, we're a little bit off, but that'll do. There we go. Okay, so that should power the amenity there. Um, we'll probably need another one on the other side as well. Probably put one here here and all. Um, and then sort of... Ooh, maybe we didn't need to do that. Hold on, we'll delete this bit of fence. Go back, connect that to there, and then that to there. There we go! Isn't it beautiful? Using the expedition center. This is a good idea. Someone once said. Right. Now, ooh, a parasol would be great in there. Now, it, oh, paras. Let's go for 300,000 for a para fast expedition. Hell yeah. Uh, we need more. Yeah, that's so 50% faster now. Sweet. So we have, we've got a little Gallimimus running around. Um, right. Now, yes, we're going to need two of these in here. Because this is... So I've never had an enclosure that needed that, actually. <laughs> There's two of them. Uh, we'll have... I don't know who's he, what he's already got. Signpost. Assigned to a post. It doesn't tell me which one. Uh, we'll put him on that one. And then the other one is on Ranger Post 2. So there we go. Uh, and I, I really wanted to put a gate on here so they can get through. But it's not happy with us, so... Ah, it is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. But I'm assuming that these galleys are going to be completely fine. I can't imagine there's anything in here. Maybe apart from, like, ground fiber or ground leaf? I'll just put some down. There's your ground fiber. There's your leaf, whatever. And I think you'll be, you'll be hunky-dory in there. So, now, unless... Ooh, James, instead of facilities, we can just put these down. We'll put one there. And we'll put another one here. Yeah, now we don't get to see too much out of that. So what if we put a viewing platform? Now all our logistics are gone. <laughs> what we need is research. Once they're done, oh God. Once they're done, we'll get like a staff facility so we can get more staff. All right. Yeah, maybe we can fit in a little like a mini facility here. Ooh. Oh, damn it. <laughs> we can definitely fit in the toilet, though. Yeah! Look at that! Much better! Or at least it looks much better to me. <laughs> Dirty. We could put some sand here. Oh, yes. Yeah, look at that! Beautiful. 
Have we checked in the galleys? I think we have, yeah. Okay. So we need to increase our total number of dinosaurs. Or maybe we haven't even checked on the galleys. Could we please check on the galleys? Just make sure they're okay. Thank you! Right, guys. You need to make... You need to research yourselves. You need to look inwards and see what do you want. There you go. All right, what did we actually get? Let's have a look. It should be a para. I'd be very surprised if it was anything but. All right. Uh, four for you, four for you, and a two for you. Sweet. Jesus, this filled up bloody quick. It's already on 200 out of 200. Did it take it away from this? Uh, no. Wow, we are making a hell of a profit now, I think. Yeah. These are all, like, instantly filled up. Oh, the, the ginger beer is not, but... Jesus! Wah, make a Jurassic World a success within two bloody seconds! Right, we've also got... Oh, Avery and other nodes available. <laughs> okay, I guess because we hit two stars. Right. So we got Ornithomimus as well. That's unlocked. Um, I was wanting a staff facility because we're going to need this, definitely. Uh, we'll put this at the back as well. It'd be really cool if we could put, like, little fences in. Not like a... You know, it doesn't have to be an electric fence, but little fence would be quite nice. So we're getting that staff facility sword. We've got the T-Rex, which just likes to hide away from the guests because nobody wants to see it, apparently. <laughs> Uh, and then we need, like, a gyrosphere tour to go around into here. I don't want to change it. It looks really cool with all the marshes and stuff. Uh, but we will send out another dig team. Uh, see if there's another uh, para anywhere. Draco. Ugh. Ugh, Draco Rex. <laughs> there we go. Faster, Reese. Faster thingies. That'll do. That'll do. Speed up time. All right. Approved staff. There we go. Right. Can we hire more staff? I always need more staff. What we got? We can get two more. Faster incubation. Okay. Cheaper synthesis. That could be good. Faster incubation as well. Hmm. Any tens? Uh, we do. We have a ten for genetics, which That's is also ten. cheaper synthesis. Heck yeah. 640,000. You are an expensive bugger. Uh, faster incubation. We've got eight for welfare. I want logistics. Reduces the salary by 50%. Okay. I think we could get better, though. You know, I'll take you for now. I'll take you for now. You'll do. You'll do for now. Right. Is this a regular looking T-Rex? Uh, ooh, maybe. Maybe. Infamy level zero. Okay, it's been in no fights whatsoever. It needs a friend, though. It needs a mate. Are you okay? Oh, my God. I can't believe... Oh, here we go. We got ones. Okay, you need ground leaf. Wow, even after all this, you're still not happy? <laughs> Good lord, spoil rotten, you buggers, huh? Right, I'm just gonna put it there. Because it, it doesn't need to ever release anything into the enclosure, so... I think I think we'll be okay there. It, it'll do. It'll do. As long as it doesn't affect the T-Rex's environment. It did! I thought it took away some of his forest. There you go, be happy now! Right, power's on 64. Really? I spent 300,000? You didn't get anything? Oh my god. Is there another place for a Paris? Oh, there it is. Paris and galleys. Good, good, good. Right, okay. Seeing as we're sort of branching over here as well, what we'll do is when we can... Oh, ooh, I want to pause this a little bit because this this is bugging us. It's doing a weird thing. Right, so we'll kind of follow around. Yeah, I guess. We'll go around this way. Oh, well, I'll tell you what. I'll grab from here. And then we can just, like, make that straight there. Perfect. Okay, now that's there. We can add one of these. And when we can't... There it is. Beautiful. Okay, it needs a little bit of power. Maybe we should research the substations. Like, the larger ones. Because I usually leave that to last. But, uh, I think I shouldn't. I think I'll, I'll definitely pick that up. Oh, look at it! Yeah! Maybe it's not the best looking, but... Oh, you yeah, walk down here. There's the hotel with a beautiful swimming pool and here's how you view more of the dinosaurs right that was actually quick one ho oh, oh lordy did we get some good fossils one two three two there let's shove in some chairs yes and some lights for a night time yes 
And what would a main street be if we didn't place down some of these bad boys? Bam! It's a bam! And a blue one! I like to think I'm just placing them on top of people and deleting them, but I don't think I am. New viable genome. I don't really want a Gallimimus. I've got, uh, I guess I could make more, I suppose. But we should have some more fossils. Fuff of. Oh, we're in the money. Oh, it's it's all Gallimimus. It's all. Wow, Parasaur is evading me. And I have no idea why. Why? Why are you doing this to me? I'm going to have to send you back, aren't I? Oh, you're completed over there now. Okay, so because there's no more galley. But how about we just get, you know, better Paris, please? Thank you. You know what? I might as well. I might as well just get some more galleys while I'm here. Oh, God, because I need more research. All right. Look, the sun comes and warms the cold-blooded, uh, or should I say warm-blooded, dinosaurs. Look at you. So cute. So we're on two and a bit stars. Not bad. We've been playing for 40 minutes, so already... We're, with, because we're having to make more of a park and we're not having as many species dropped in, um, yeah, it is It is taking a little bit longer. Can we do any research? I want uh, guest comfort. Yeah, I want this sort of thing. I want to get up to... Uh, well, we've already got a wide path, but we need a luxury wide path. That's what we need. So we need to get two stars, 500 guests, and we need the prerequisite, which is that one. Okay. Oh, oh, yep, still doing good. 300,000. Are you kidding me? Is that all you got from that para? Why? Why do I send you over there? Sod it. You're going to get something else then. Edmontosaurus? I guess it's cheaper, sure. <laughs> Why not, seeing as you can't seem to find anything else? Go on then, off you pop. Oh, that's really quick. Wow, okay. Right, now I can do. Let's go. Assign a scientist. Oh, is there anything in particular there bad? I think Gallimimus is all good, yeah. Let's uh, let's change up the skin now that I've got loads of different patterns. Oh, never mind. Okay. Uh, let's make a Salda... Who has or whatever it's called. Let's make one of those. Assign um, cheaper synthesis. Heck yeah, only 21,000. It still seems to take a while. Expected survival rate is 80%. That's because we've got 100% genome. And we have one, two, three, four, five for 300,000. Not too bad. Cheap incubation. And we need a good welfare. There we go. 30%. Not bad. And I think I needed to put something on a, on a timeout. Yeah, there you go. Ooh, some of you can be upgraded. Well, I'll get you in genetics. There you go. Guess in my downtime, I'm like, oh, okay. Let's place some of these planters around. One. Oh, I tell you what. If you could switch between, that would be so good. If you could make it like a little hotkey. Because then I'd put two like that. And then if you could copy and paste and just do that all the way, that would be brilliant, but I can't. <laughs> oh, there you go. Gallimimus ready. Uh, release fire air. Yeah, definitely don't release them into the T-Rex enclosure. It's something, un it's definitely going to happen 100%. So if we get Paras and we get Edmontosaurus, that would be fantastic. So we'll send a dig team back over. Uh, where are they? There they are, Edmontosaurus. Faster expedition and yeah, 47% quicker. That's not bad. And let's see if we can do a para. No, we can't because we've got somebody on rest. Can we do it now? Yes, we can. Uh, now let's see. Have I got... Oh my god. So for Chaos Theory, you can't really do much for skins. Let's make a red one. Actually, no. I don't like that. I think I like the regular. <laughs> Death Valley. Let's go with Death Valley. Look nice. Yeah, sure. Um, cheaper synthesis and that. So there you go. Done and done. And if I have a chance, can I place down something? Place down one of these? There we go. Place down. Yeah, that's good. I like that. There, we'll break that up. And then we'll add... Ooh, I'll add one of these. Different one. Although that's... Oh, I can't place in there. We're going to have to get something... Oh, a light. Oh, perfect. Yes. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're starting to look nice now. And we need to do the other side. Okay. But first, 
We've got eggs. Oh dear. Thirsty, social, and dominance. T tolerant? 30% chance to attack a ranger team and plus 30% cohabitation. Oh, you're a nightmare. Uh, we'll select one. We'll get the thirsty. And then I don't want the tolerant. Do I want social? Nah, I think we'll just have two from that one, which is 300,000. And then we'll probably uh, do some more here. Thirsty's okay. I don't really mind thirsty. Like, what? He, he just wants to drink more? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, put you in. And then I think there's some need timeouts. Like you. Unassigned. Oh, we can train you. More logistics. And train you to be... Oh, you've got potential in both. We'll do logistics, though. And you... Ah, oh, welfare. There we go. Right. One. Oh my god, you get nothing. What is with this game and getting nothing from these sites? All I want is more Montosaurus. It's deliberate. Where is more Montosaurus? It's got to be somewhere. Oh, there's a pa- Ah. Ah, that's why I couldn't get anything. Because <laughs> there was another site I could have got DNA from the power from. God damn it. You're an idiot, James. But we'll love you. <laughs> <laughs> right, I want more. Put one there. Can I put it really close? Oh, I can put it really close. Sweet. Yeah, look at that. And then, I can place a spino skull. And turn it around. Look at me! And then, we get a really small radius tool. And then make some sand. Oh. And then maybe a little bit of dirt. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Alright, expeditions. What did we get? Oh my god, we got everything. Four. And... Oh, okay. I didn't put the other ones in. Fair enough. And you. There we go. Gonna make a lot of money from that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I guess you can just do it by yourself. And then we got loads that are on a timeout. You. You. And then... Terrajack still needs to do something. Right. How about you have a picnic? We'll put some brollies up. So one brolly up, one brolly up, and one brolly up. And then we'll grab the brolly down. Have a brolly down. Brolly down. Brolly down. Brolly down. Brolly down. <laughs> I think we need more brollies ups. Brolly up. Brolly up. There you go. Nice. I like it. But we need some lights. Because then it looks kind of weird. Have a little light there. Although they don't really shine much light, do they? Eh. Eh. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, yes. Three eggs, but they're all great. Okay, so we need five for this. So we've got five... And uh, I want cheap incubation and that one as well. There we go. So 300,000 for that. And then we're going to have to wait, unfortunately, because I don't have that many welfares. Oh, dear. Right, let's have a look. So we've got crowd in there. No need for toilets. A little bit of shelters on the side, but that's all right. Yeah, and it's basically just everything but thrills at the moment. That's because we don't have any rides. Coverage is pretty decent. Yeah, wide path is done. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, main thoroughfare. Yes, I can do it. Yay. Cheap research. That one and that one. <laughs> Twice as fast. Ooh, main thoroughfare two unlocked as well. Ooh. Right, so, ooh, is it cheaper incubation? And we just need you and you. And there we go. 30%, or at least 30% off. We've got deals on Paris here. Okay, so this is another new species. One, two, three. They probably will need more. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. And Montosaurus is on 75% now. Uh, we'll send them back. It's only 200,000. Faster. And then uh, that one. Oh, yes. That's gorgeous. All right. And you're unassigned so we can train you. Oh, you're a genetic specialist. Heck yeah. Let's rest you too. You know what it is? I'm also going to research this when I can. The 50% and egg bays. Because... It's actually really freaking good. <laughs> Especially in a speedrun. I'd love to see like speedrun strats for this. That'd be amazing. Yes, T-Rex. No, you can't have any. No para burgers for you. All right, let's see what fossils we got for Edmonto. Oh. 
a fair amount. Nice. Okay. And yeah, I want to increase the uh, the capacity so we can do 10 instead of just 5, I think. Or no, it's probably like 4, 8, 5, 6, 7. 7. So I think we get 3 extra or 4 extra, something like that. Right. You're done. Release fire airlift. Almost release their normal. Sweet. Okay. So Paras, how are you doing? You want ground nut. I forgot Paras want ground nut. A little bit of ground nut. There. Wow, yeah. They're, they're going to be completely fine. So, oh, one social issue. Well, you, what, what do you mean a social? Oh, you're lonely. I was going to say, don't tell me you don't like the bloody galleys. Oh, Lord. Okay, so your social issue is you need like five or so. Okay. What's in Montessor? Uh, uh, Short-lived. Yes, we'll definitely have to research that. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, never mind. Done. <laughs> All right, foreign Montessoris. Do you think that's that's around about right? Uh, we'll see. We'll see, won't we? Uh, I don't have any cheap incubation here, so this will cost me six hundred and odd thousand. But I think it'll be all right. And oh man, so we, should we have Avery's to the left and then a lagoon to the right? That's a good idea. Brilliant, James. Well done. Right, what we'll also put in just because I know they're asking for it already is a uh, is a shelter on both sides. So we'll, we'll, we'll pop that in. Oh, the paras are fitting in nicely. Woo! Yeah, this is big. We could definitely put a parasaur in. I'm sure we can. Sure we can. Right, let's research some bad boys. Marines unlocked. Wait, Mosasaur is the first thing I can do? Okay. But it's like it wants me to. What about uh, Pteranodons? Uh, Dimorphodon. Okay, okay. I think it's already unlocked, actually. Yeah. Oh, wait. We need to construct a lagoon. Ah, okay. So, we first to do that, we're gonna need, I think... Oh! Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so in order to get this, progress the mission. Oh, so we're gonna do it anyway. Uh, building upgrades for hatcheries. Yes! That's what I wanted. So, we'll do... Uh, oh, I'm going to wait for somebody to come back because I think I've, I've got the cheaper research uh, already queued up with the eggs. Yeah, I do. I've got a... Oogie doggie! Fire airlift! Let we can. Hopefully the Montessor will be fine. On my own. Well, it's been told to me anyway. Rather harshly, I might add. Yeah, point is, we need extra hands. So we're oh. adding some fresh blood to the team. Meet Claire Deering. No! Hey. Why? Thank you, Cabot. Oh, I'm so excited to be part of the team. I bet I look you are. forward to us all working together to make Jurassic World all that it can and should be for our guests and our dinosaurs. Now, our first task is to increase our guest count. <laughs> I'm confident we can get this done. Oh, God, I don't like your tone, Claire. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have a big My loop going around is that here. The gyrosphere attraction is ready. This is essential to giving our guests those true "you are there" dinosaur moments that will drive new and repeat business. That means, of course, that we'll need to make sure they see plenty of dinosaurs, Claire, more than right. they can handle. Yes, sir. We can handle that. Oh, so Claire's, Claire's just started fresh meat before she became, or maybe when she is all business, business. No, pally, pally. Okay, can I go cut across here? Sweet, yes. A, it, oh, God, that's a bit lopsided, isn't it? Oh, no, I don't like it. Is there no way we can fix this? Um, Hold on, let me place the path first. I want to place the path first, and then we can work around it. Why not? It's right there. Is it just too... It's probably just too close, isn't it? Is it going to be the same with the other one? Oh, I don't think it will be, actually, because there's a tiny bit of gap. Yeah, okay, okay. Right, so that fence is just a little bit too close. Or the path is. Okay, let's delete this. Oh, my God. What the hell's going on in here? Two seconds. Two friggin' seconds. Oh, God, yes. I forgot. <laughs> I've also changed the settings so dinosaur don't display anything. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's turn those back on. That might be good. 
Yes, now I can actually see stuff. That's probably why I didn't even notice anything. Oh, God. Oh, this doesn't look good, does it? I've made the dinosaurs as best I can. But sickness is a reality. And treatment is a necessity. Oh. What do you mean, treatment? They've got a freaking common cold. There's now I can do. I've just got to click on all the ones that have low health and just hope they don't die. That's literally all I can do. This is me for the next hour. <laughs> Claire, uh, Mr. Mazrani would like to see an uptick in the guest count. That oh. means we need enough accommodation to cater to a larger audience. Those are real profit generators. Absolutely. We will make sure to focus on it as we move forward. Okie dokie. <laughs> like I said, this is me for the next hour. <laughs> Until they all recover. This is costing me valuable fleet fuel, damn it. Right, sort of. If someone dies now, it's all right. There you go. More fuel. Right, so we've increased the number of VIP guests. Or at least we did for a second there. Um, oh, we've got something on low health. Stop. I know. I know. There's now I can do, though. You just chip, 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 chip. Chip. <laughs> Who's being a ganged up on there by a bunch of galleys? Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Right, okay, so we need to increase VIP guest. Um, medium amenity, large amenity. What is it? What's the one? I don't know if I've got it. Um, yeah, because these are just the same, I think. Yeah, they're not what I, they're not like the um, the other thing I'm thinking of with the cinema and the bowling and stuff. Maybe it's in, maybe it's in here? No? Hey. Right, well, we need a hotel anyway. Hotel! Hotel there. And then we can place another hotel at the side. That's how we like to do things, isn't it, James? Yes. Right, let's research that bigger substation. Get more coverage. <laughs> I love that we're just shoving like these friggin' power things inside the enclosures. It's brilliant! Now increase profit per minute. Okay. So yeah, we've got a lot of things over here. Uh, food and drink. Ooh, yes. Okay, hold on a second while I place a million amenities, guys. <laughs> Okay, just a couple do need power, but apart from that, we good. Oh, I did. Did I do it? Oh, I did something. I don't know what that was, but I did it. <laughs> Research complete. I can now do Majunga Bunga. Right, okay, but I, I, I'm still after that bloody lagoon, but I need to progress the mission, I think, first. So, with that in mind, let's go for a Padasaur. I think that's probably the best thing here. And we can probably put that in and it won't be a single... Well, at least there shouldn't be a single issue with that. Yes, I know you're disgruntled. God! Yeah, so the way you've got to play this game is you put an enclosure down, leave room for amenities, and then put another enclosure behind the same amenities, and then put a viewing. And then you just end up with this, like, it just works. It all, like, fits together like a bloody uh, jigsaw. Right, a padasaur. Here we go. Oh, oh it... Did I not do the other things? Oh, never mind. My bad. We're going to do that. There you go. Done. I wish we had more decorations, though. There's only so much I can do with these. There, just put one in the middle. There you go. Look at that. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, for God's sake. You and your bloody pneumonia. There you go. Go on, then. I'll give you level threes. Cheaper research. One is disgruntled, but ah, sod him. <laughs> He'll be fine. 
Oh, look. The oh, Ranger Tim. Oh. What? It was destroyed by the T-Rex. Bloody Nora. That's only ever happened like twice to me. Okay, I guess we've got to buy another one for 50 grand. Is that all it costs? Uh, yeah, okay, that sounds about right, yeah. <laughs> oh, Edmontosaurus completely rude. All right, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have ten spots. Okay, two, four, six, seven. You can get an extra seven. Gotcha. Yeah, put them both on it. Why not? And then I don't know. Ah, I can't send everybody out just yet. All right. Let's have a look. Who's making profit? Oh, Lord. Oh, that's luxury. I want to see all. General. Do you mean not making profit? You are making profit. <laughs> Don't know what that was. Didn't sound good. <laughs> oh, ah! All right. Okay. We can train our peeps again. Get you completely great with genetics. Uh, you're, you know, you can be a, you can be a mixture. You can be a little bit of welfare. Uh, what about you? Oh, you as well. You can be a mixture. And allow you. Oh, she's amazing with welfare. There you go. A Panasaurus, new viable genome. Fantastic. But I do want more Edmontosaurus. Not Edmontosaurus, a Patasaurus. Good lord. <laughs> oh, no. God, well, it doesn't really matter. If I dead, 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 done. Bam. Off we go. Friggin' disease. Oh, it's just pneumonia. Oh, my God. We're finally over this. Come on. Get over yourselves, damn it. <laughs> right, we need more dinosaurs. So let's have a look. The Apatosaurus, it has a large appetite. So let's see if we can slow this down. Right, what do we need? I bet you it's release a dinosaur with large appetite. Release a dinosaur with large... God damn it. <laughs> Nothing I could do. At least we're making a profit. Don't know what people are on about. Oh, God. Storm warning. All right. Open all shelters. I'm not too sure what this is going to be. Maybe it'll take out... Oh, it's damaging buildings and fences. That's what this does. All right. We're probably going to need another um, ranger station, I think. Oh, God. What do you, what do you mean, fence broken? Where, 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 where? We can probably... Oh, God. Is it in here? Oh, what, this little bit? Ah, it's fine. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. Don't you love it? And then, bam, sword. Right, let's keep an eye on make sure no other fences are broken or break. I think we're good. Yes, I think that's the worst of it. It seems to hit you all at once at the start, and then the rest of it's like, eh. It's all raging outside, but you don't really care about it. And there you go. Just like that, storm over. And only a, only a few bits of smoke. It's fine. Oh, she's happy. Look, they're happy with it. They don't mind. They don't know whether it's things cooking or things burning and catching a light. Oh. Oh. Well, it's not my fault. I forgot to open the shelters. <laughs> close, sorry. It's so... You think close the shelters is like open them, but it's not. Ah, it's so confusing. And so is clicking the escape button every two seconds. Look at all of you. How did you get in there? How did you all fit? Nobody knows. Oh, yeah, that's a point. What about uh, shelters? Yeah, I thought it would be quite low. Oh, we could fit one right in there. Perfect. Do we need another one? Oh, something's out of power. Oh, God. Oh, that's right. It's being repaired. It's fine. It's fine. Give it a second. Give it a second. Power will be restored to the park momentarily. Also, let's put another one next to it. If I can. Sweet. And then we connect that to that one. And then boom. Double powerage. Really see no reason ever to make a medium one. You spend money researching it. And then it spends even more money making it. And do you really need that much power? Yeah, probably not. Look at this. I'm quite happy with this. It's nice. It's not the most uh, experimental looking park, but it looks nice. Looks nice. <laughs> right, so we still need to increase profits. And I'm sure we'll do that once we get this bloody apatosaur done. Right, did we get anything else for it? 
Oh, yes. I think we might have done it. Right, so it's genetic. So I'm going to do her and then put that in. And then there we go. Brilliant. Wait, do you not want to re fix it? Yeah, there we go. Oh, I never checked the Monosaur. Cohabitation's low. Oh, do they not get on with something? Is it just too small? Oh, God. Okay, maybe uh, maybe a Parasaur needs to be in its own thing. If cohabitation. What about the Para? Is Para okay? Oh, we'll find one that's actually been checked. Uh, it needs a little bit more ground note. Uh, cohabitation's all right. But I could imagine... Uh, what's it called? The Apatosaur not really being that happy. So we're going to have to place another enclosure, actually. All right, let's do that then. All right, guys, here's the plan. We've got this super long exhibit. Uh, it's all right. Imagine it's, it's a giant hair piece. That, that's the way I see it. So we've got this giant hair piece. And then it sort of loops around. We join back up and boom, look at that. There we go. And then we can have a patasaurus on one side, then maybe like, I don't know, some other herbivores on the other side. And then at these bits, because it actually does go out quite a bit. I mean, if we ever look at the map, like, good lord, this is ginormous. We could probably put a carnivore here, and then a carnivore here, and have like the paths branch out this way. Like we just sort of, I don't know. Maybe we probably need a monorail. Maybe we put a monorail here, and then, because then it's not too far away from them getting in. So they get in here, they walk this way, go in there, and then a monorail can take them somewhere else. We could probably put two monorails or something. I don't know. Well, we'll delete this path. For, oh, oh no, that's right. We need this. Oh, do we? Oh, yeah. It actually does need to be connected. That's interesting. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it does count as part of our, of our facility up here. The command operation. Oh, look at that. That looks so cool. Sweet. Okay, let's play that then. Okay, Apatosaurus, you are on 100%. Sweet. Okay, I'm assuming I can't really add many, many different things. No. Death Valley. Let's go for some pale ones. Pale Apatosaurus. Although, I, I bet they don't look like that. Um, oh, God. Oh, fine. Oh, all right, all right. You can rest. Ooh, and you can be trained even better in logistics. And so can you. Better in logistics. What we will also do is get some compies. Then we'll put them in the um, the T-Rex enclosure. Because the compies go with anything. At least it's another species we've got added to it. It's a little bit more realism. Because T-Rex would want something to, like, you know, scavenge. I do feel like we should probably have the pylons go around the outside of this place, though. <laughs> we basically have it already. So, yeah, we'll put that there, connect that, and then we can just delete this one in the middle because there's no real need for it. Looked a bit unsightly. Oh, 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 oh. All the sharks. How much do we get for that? 103,000 each? Jesus. And a little bit of a compy, why not? Tell you what, like half a million for a friggin' compy, like a dig site, that's a lot. Fragile little bones they have. 